Good Saturday afternoon to everyone out there. Alex Puckett here in the WVUA 23 Weather Center. This is your weather webcast for Saturday. And we'll go ahead and start with our look at radar. And unfortunately, fortunately for the football fans, it's dry. But unfortunately for a lot of the state that needs a lot of rain, we're dealing with pretty severe drought conditions across the state. No rain in sight this afternoon. We're not going to see any rain on the future cast either. Although note, for those of you enjoying the Alabama game, uh, temperature is going to drop below 60, likely by the time the game's over. So a little bit chilly out there if you're planning on celebrating after the game in downtown. Make sure you layer up if you're spending time outdoors. So a cool night in store. And then for your Sunday, the big sports story is going to be the big race at the Talladega Super Speedway. Temperature's going to make it into the mid to upper eight, uh, 70s, excuse me, uh, about race time. So again, probably a good idea to dress in layers because it's going to start off cool and then warm up throughout the day. And then again, cooler off, a cool, little bit cooler in the evening, maybe a few clouds making its way into the forecast by Monday, but unfortunately, no rain in sight. Now our best our next chance of rain, I should say, not our best chance of rain, is going to be better evidenced on this 500 millibar forecast. Now, this is sort of looking up into the middle and upper parts of the atmosphere. We've got that trough that moved through that led to that cold front. That's giving us the nicer temperatures right now. But notice back off to the west towards Dallas and Houston, you see what looks like a ridge. It's high pressure. That's where those deep reds and browns are. And that sort of shifts off to the east towards us, but it sort of backs out as another trough makes its way through. Now, this isn't a particularly strong trough. This is for late Wednesday into early Thursday, but that might give us just a very slight chance of a stray shower or two. But unfortunately, it's not going to be the good widespread soaking rain we need. And in fact, I think most spots are just going to see a few more clouds out of this. Not what we had in mind for a drought buster. The rest of your evening, pretty cool out there and nice. Low of 40 under clear skies. Tomorrow, a decent amount warmer. High right around 80. It's sunny, but still fairly nice outside and mild. Dry conditions across the state. So those dew points aren't going to be affecting heat index values or anything like that. Next seven days, we were looking for rain, we're hoping for rain, but we don't see it in the next seven days. Maybe a stray shower late Wednesday night into Thursday morning into the early afternoon hours, but most spots just going to stay bone dry.